Hi everybody. Here is an example uh, to help you solve your uh, assignment. Um, I know that the problem that you face is just integration. And if you look for uh, the table of integrals, you will find there are many formula and you can use one of them. But let me tell you, I mean, uh, uh, that how can you do that? The basic concept is very simple. It's just as I told you the integration. So let's just do something very similar to what you have. I have here like a, a sawtooth uh, uh, waveform and the period from uh, minus one half to one half. So the period of this function is equal to one second. And if you like to find the frequency omega naught, that will be equal to pi over t. So omega naught is equal to pi. And the period is one second, and you can you are free. You can take it from zero to uh, one, because from zero to half, from half to one, that will be one period. Or you take from minus one half to one half, and that's what I'm going to uh, take it. So I will just I have to find the expression for the function from minus one half to one half. It means that I got to find expression for the function over one period. You choose any period, whatever you like. I'm, I'm choosing from minus one half to one half. When you look at it, you will see it. It just it look like a straight line. And the slope is like uh, two because it's changing from minus one from minus one to one. That's two over the period one. So the, the, the slope is equal to. So I can say that the function x of t is equal to t and pass through the origin. So just it's 2t and I will say that's when t belong to minus one half to one half. It means that the time start from minus one half up to one half. That's expression over one period I choose. Uh, when you look at the function, you will see, you can verify that it's an odd function. So that will make it easy and simple. It means you don't have to find uh, A naught and AK, only BK. So the Fourier series will be only sign terms that you're going to have. And let me write the expression for odd function uh, when you want to do the Fourier series. Uh, well, uh, let's just... Uh, remind you that this is an odd function and odd function it means a naught is equal a k equal zero and the uh for for year series it's it only it will have only uh the um, uh, sign terms so how can you find the sign terms it means you need only b k b k and odd function will be 4 over 2. Remember, it's 2 over t when it's normal. It's not odd or even. But this is odd. So, be 4 over t. And you are going to integrate over only half the period. That will be from 0 to 1 half. That's half period. Because the period from minus 1 half to 1 half, that's the, the complete period. I'm going to only 1 half. Because it's an odd function. Symmetric. And the function x of t... Well, I mean, just uh, what, what, what about if just I uh, write the formula and then I substitute as usual, as we used to do. BK for odd function, let me just write for not for every function, for odd function, will be equal 4 over T, the period, and the integration over half period, and will be X of T times sine K omega naught t dt well now i'll start substitute 4 over t the period is equal 1 and half period will be from 0 to 1 half and x of t we already found it here x of t is equal to t so that be equal to 2t and sine k and omega naught is equal to pi t dt now just let's I mean, just uh, uh, arrange the terms here of the equation so 2 times 4 is equal 8 so you have 8 and the integration from 0 to 1 half and you have only t sine and let's just uh, write this in a nice way 2 pi kt dt so that's what you get and if you do in your homework the problem that it is going to be like uh, 
similar to this one and you have an extra term because in, in, in the function in your assignment it doesn't pass through the origin like this one and the slope is negative and pass I think through one or minus one so it's just like I mean be like I mean like 2t minus 1 or 2t plus 1 something like that so we'll have an extra term but the other term is easy to find its integration because we like only sine or cosine but here that's the problem and this is a problem you face and I expect you to ask about that because I mean just it's it's a it's a mathematical problem it, but I mean the concept you know the equation the equation are very the same I mean you, you don't have problem to find the equation for the odd or the even it's there in the, in the handout but the problem is to do the integration so it's a good way to practice what you learned before in calculus because I mean you you are you're not going just to face in uh, in any mathematical or engineering problem you just face very simple one every time you will find something like that so how you do that I did I mean uh, you can do that integration by parts but to make it easy for you I added uh, uh, some important integration formula and I gave you the sheet and this sheet is available you can find it everywhere but I just I I already uh, uploaded the, the folio with a big table of integration you will not need all of it but just in a case you need it in any subject in any way I simplified for you and I did a formula uh, uh, that when you, what happened when you when there is a function like t multiplied by sine function of t so I you will see in the in the note that I put that the integration for t sine ct c is a constant uh, then it's equal to 1 over c square sine ct minus ct multiplied by cosine ct and then you put the limit of the integration be that's I mean uh, the, uh, that's a formula you can find it by by uh, integration by parts but just I I brought in the in the folio to make it easy when you compare this formula to what do you have you'll find this is your C so I will do the same thing here so I can write now the expression for B that's the expression for BK BK now if I apply this formula will be equal to uh, 8 let me write just I mean make sure yes 8 that's right and then the integration will be the same but just I I, I put C equal to 2 pi K uh, I have the formula here in front of me so I will have 8 and divided by C square C square will be 2 by K so it'll be 4 by square k square and then I have sine ct so I will have sine ct will be 2 pi kt minus ct will be 2 pi kt multiplied by cosine ct cosine 2 pi kt and the limit I have here the limit from 0 up to one half so the problem is solved now you know but I'll continue to do that was I mean that 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 what you face I believe I mean how how to integrate something like that so it, it's equal to I will leave this one as it is it four pi square k square and now sine 2 by kt one time I bought one half and one time I put zero to find this term. So just let's, I mean, just postpone this a little bit because I mean, we have many terms. So this term, how can you find it? Well, uh, you just substitute sine, but substitute by t equal to one half. So one half times two, it will be gone, will be have pi k minus zero will be sine zero sine 0 is equal 0 and sine pi k when you put k equal 1 2 3 we have sine pi sine 2 pi so that's equal 0 2 so this term is equal 0 so this one will be equal 0 now it's reduced to this one all right so now let's just write our formula now bk will be equal 8 divided by 4 pi square k square 
and you have negative sign as you know I'm an, I, I will get rid of it now I'll show you how to do that and then 2 pi k t cosine 2 pi k t and the limit if I want to get rid of this negative sign I'll flip the, the integration limit so that's what I have now I will uh, I will have here I mean 2 times 8 divided by 4 that will be equal to 4 right and pi and k cancel with the square of here pi square k square so you have only pi k on the bottom and then you got t because i mean this is i mean that t equal zero and t equal half so i have to have it inside t cosine 2 pi k t all right now uh, i got to substitute one time zero one time half so just let me write this one 4 over pi k and t will be 0 times anything will be 0 minus and I have cosine uh, uh, half so I have here 1 half because I mean one time I substitute the whole expression by t equal 0 that's gone 0 and then the second time I, I, I substitute by t equal half so this is t is equal half cosine half times 2 would be 1 so be by k so that's the expression that we got for vk if you multiply it you got 2 and you have negative sign pi over k cosine pi k so that's the expression for bk i can go you know and continue because i know pi k it will have something uh, k could be odd and could be even and when it's odd like uh, 1 3 5 so cosine pi cosine 3 pi that will give me negative 1 so that will give me cosine be equal to negative 1 and when it's even it will give me a positive 1 so this ex so I mean cosine so cosine pi over k if we can make it minus 1 over k see it's right or wrong when k is odd like 1 or 3 minus 1 power 3 is equal minus 1 that's right and even all right so i can do it like that so i can say b of k is equal minus 2 over pi k minus 1 to the power of k of course you don't have to do what i'm doing now but i'm just telling you that how you do it now uh, you, uh, you you're done almost done you're done now i mean just you you have to write the expression for for year transform x of t uh, to find x of t and you know the expression it will have the sigma it will be equal sigma and from n start from 1 to infinity bk sine only term because it's odd function sine uh, uh, n uh, k omega naught t and we know omega naught is equal to pi so we might do it like I mean to directly here to pi k t and if you like i mean to just i mean show it so you have b1 b1 when you have b1 here we have minus 2 over pi both k equal 1 and that will be negative so we be here positive 2 over pi and sine both k equal 1 it will be have 2 pi t plus let's take the the second one when you have 2 so k equal 2 that will be positive that will be negative so you'll have this one will be negative the coefficient will be negative and you have 2 k equal 2 cancel the 2 you have 1 over pi and you have sine and then k is equal to you have 4 pi t and then you can continue i just i'm trying to lay out that's it so i didn't see any problem except only maybe then i expect that that only thing that you faced how can you integrate these things all right and i showed you on the hypotenuse. and by the way i mean always expect that when you do the homework you face some kind of 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 mathematical problem or maybe some trick then you got to think about it and then if you can't then you can you can search and then you can ask this is very normal i mean nothing life just go i mean everything just easy like that right all right i hope that helped and if you have any question please don't hesitate to ask me and thank you very much